All right, we're going to get on a flight to go down to Talladega. Woo! NASCAR time, it's gonna be really cool. Now this is the first flight we have been on where we have not had to wear a mask. Man. Oh. I'm gonna wear one anyway, because I love people. Do the work. Do the work. Now what changed? What, you gotta ask yourself, what's actually changed? Science. Yeah, I think the science, because I think it's time for us to do what is timely, timing possible. It is time for us to do what we have been doing and that time is every day because i think it's time for us to do what is timely timing possible time zone timetable time cop time turner timing time and space timeliness <laughs> time after time one of my favorite songs of all time do not wear a mask yes No mask. I really hope that there are some Christians on here doing the work, showing, fulfilling. Who wrote Purpose Driven Life? I can't remember the commie's name. Rick Warren. Like the government wouldn't have you do something if it wasn't really good because yeah, that guy, just like he said, wearing a mask is fulfilling the, the commandment. Rotten commie. Or I'm gonna get really upset because those Christians ought to know that it's time to do what is timing best for time zone, time cop, timeliness. Another option. <laughs> Another option is that they realize that the science actually has not changed. The literature has not changed. We've known this for a very, very long time. Cloth masks don't do anything. That's kind of like what we've always known. Nothing is changing except everything is changing. Lord, I wish I had something I could throw. The data hasn't changed. We've known the research of masking on planes for literally two years and none of that data has changed. The science is not the same thing as science. The science with a capital T and a capital S should be called the narrative with a capital T and a capital N. What this means is simply this, is that the science has just become basically a tool of ideology to press down an agenda. So it should be called the narrative. Trust the narrative, believe in the narrative. Dr. Fauci is the narrative. Huh? That's why in this sense, it has become basically kind of like a religious system. It's a religious set of beliefs that are irrational, that you are not allowed to question. You just have to believe them as presuppositions. And that's the whole point, isn't it? We'll let you know how it goes. I think if you really love people, you dye your hair purple. I think that's accurate. The Daily Coop.